Have you guys ever worked on a game in the studio and then realized that if you're in first person and then open up a GUI, your screen gets locked? And that's because in first person, your mouse gets locked to the middle of the screen and you can't exit out of the GUI that pops up. Well, if you run into this issue, don't worry. I found a solution. I'll be showing you guys how to fix this problem in your game. So the first thing you're going to want to do is get this free model that I've added in the description of this video. And then once you've done that, go ahead and open it in studio. And so this is the current game that I'm working on. And as you can see, if I'm in first person and I open up a GUI, my mouse is locked. And the only thing I can do right now is leave. And it's pretty frustrating. So let's go ahead and fix this. So first, what I'm going to do is pull that script that I got from the toolbox and add it to my workspace. Go ahead and add that in. And once it's in the workspace, all we have to do is ungroup it in starter player scripts. So starter player, starter player scripts, and then we can go and ungroup that. And so at this point, all we have to do now is look for the GUI we want to unlock our mouse. In this case, it's going to be for the weather machine. So this is what the GUI frame looks like. I'm going to go ahead and hide this visibility. And all I have to do is scroll down in the properties tab and add a tag called unlock first person. And it's as simple as that. All I have to do now is test. So I'm going to go ahead and go in first person again and open this GUI. And just like that, our mouse is unlocked. And we can simply just click whatever we want and exit the tab if we need to now. Now let's go ahead and test this in another game that I worked on before. So the problem with this game is that if I open the shop and then I scroll all the way to first person, you can see now my mouse is locked again and I can't move anything. So I've gone ahead and added the same script to this game and I found the Robux shop frame that I want to unlock the first person mode and all I have to do is add the tag unlock first person. So let's go ahead and test this now. And so if I open the shop and then scroll all the way to first person, you can see my mouse is now unlocked and so I can interact with this however I want. So that's perfect. And so yeah, it's really that simple and I can briefly go over how this actually works. So whenever this script runs, it listens for the tags that are on your GUI frames or screens that you added. It looks for a signal for either its enabled state or visible state to change. And so when it changes, it checks if any modal is visible that you had the tag on. And if there is a visible modal on the screen, we create an overlay which unlocks the mouse. So essentially how this works is we create a screen GUI with an invisible button that has the modal set to true. So this modal GUI takes over the input focus and allows you to unlock your cursor. And so if the visibility of the modal changes again and nothing is visible, then we remove the unlock overlay, which is basically just getting rid of that screen GUI with the button to kind of lock your mouse back into first person if you are in first person. And so that's essentially how it works. And you can even change this tag if you really want to to something simpler. So yeah, let me know if you found this helpful. And if you run into any issues with using the script, um, let me know in the comments and I'll do my best to answer any questions that you guys have. I'll see you guys in the next one.